guys, as I continue exploring the towns of uh, the northwestern part of Riyadh, this is another discovery that I have here in the village of Gasab. So in the village of Gasab, I have two discoveries already. First, the salt farm in the middle of the desert. And the second one is this one. I am so amazed finding this freshwater fish farm in the middle of the desert. And you heard it right. This is in the middle of the desert, miles and miles away from any inland body of water. So join me as I bring you the Lana Fish Farm here at the northwestern part of Riyadh province. And I am so happy also to know that the tilapia fish we are buying at the market is freshly produced here in our own place, here in Riyadh of course, because this farm is in Riyadh province. Guys, my location, we are more or less 180 kilometers away from the city center of Riyadh city. Now I would like to ask my friend here, my friend, where are we going now? Lana Fish Farm. Lana Fish Farm. In the middle of the desert. So you heard it right from my captain, Mr. Abdul Rahman, that we are on our way to Lana Fish Farm. The freshwater fish farm here in the middle of the desert and this is in the village of Gazab. After traveling for more than two hours, we are here finally at the Lana Fish Farm. Yes, my friend? Because I came here before. Okay, so please join me as I share with you how the freshwater <laughs> fish of farming is done here in the middle of the desert. And once again, this is Lana Fish Farm here in the village of Gasab. So here we go. There you see now my captain, Mr. Abdul Rahman. And this one, I think this is the drainage for the water coming out from the tanks that they have inside. Alright guys, this is another discovery that I had today here in Northwestern Riyadh. Now, it's ironic again because we are in the middle of the desert. But look what are behind me. Alright, this one of course. Uh, this gentleman, Mr. Abdurrahman, is my captain today. My friend, thank you so much for bringing me to this Yo, another welcome. another uh, exciting and amazing place. I never did imagine that we have a fish farm in the middle of the desert. So, this place actually, uh, the Gazab, uh, I think a place with plenty of surprises. Because first thing, I discovered that we have our salt farm here. And now we have a fish farm. Alright. Uh, this is a farm in the middle of the desert. Behind it directly is uh, sand dunes. But this farm is uh, one from the big farms of our fish farms here in the Riyadh area or the center of uh, Saudi Arabia. And they have two kind of farms. A kind we call bulti. Uh, it's, uh, it's a kind we eat, and even they have they have the decoration uh, like goldfish and the tropic uh, fishes over here in this farm. These are one of the hangers. There are around the twelve hangers here uh, for fish, and uh, every stage or every circle you see is a stage in the fish life. And we will walk around and see it all. So this is the method that they are doing here using the BioFlock technology through these water tanks in front of me where the fishes are kept from fingerlings up to the harvesting size. So again, they are using the BioFlock technology in fish farming. Now let me give you a close shot to the water and the ones you see flicking on the water surface are tilapias. They are uh, grown inside this water tank in front of me. And you know, this is an indoor freshwater fish farming because, you know, we are in the middle of the desert. Let me pan the camera through this way. Unfortunately, I do not know what is the name of this structure. Greenhouse? No, it's not. <laughs> because greenhouse is for the plants. But for the fish, well, fish house. Wow. Anyway, guys, whatever. 
here is another shot from the other water tank inside this structure and as you see these are tilapias and I think these tilapias are already uh, the medium size tilapias and uh, as my guide said earlier that a lot of his farm is producing and breeding two types of fishes the edible fish and the aquarium fish the edible fish of course tilapias and uh, there are several species of aquarium fishes here guys the moment you get closer to the pond the fishes are swimming coming to you opening their mouth just like what is happening now probably they are thinking that i am going to feed them and this uh, tilapias in front of me are the bigger size tilapias ready for the harvest now using the waterproof camera in my hand let us see what do we have inside this pond here we go all right my monitor shows that uh, what we have here are the small size tilapias but the same there are plenty of them and on the other concrete pond uh, of course there are tilapias and this is bigger than the first one and I also see there is a Japanese koi swimming with the tilapias now let me show you more of the place this one this driveway this is where we park our car upon our arrival to the left side is the water reservoir and to the right side is where the concrete ponds are located Now this one, this is the water reservoir. The waters are extracted from underground. And this is the one that supplies the water needs of all the pans that we have inside the farm. Twenty-nine and I find myself wondering what did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life fast forward, never turn back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And I team was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. This is the water impounding and treatment facility of the farm. The waste waters from the concrete ponds are drained into this uh, pond for treatment. So, Lanofi's farm is following the environmental health and sanitation standard. Actually, guys, if you were here, you will notice that although this is a farm, but it looks to me like a beautiful park. The place is clean and it is amiable. You gave me the soul I had to take Without you I never could have moved away But now I seek what you teach I do believe I always should have stayed yeah. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true I'm just this surprised it's you So guys, let us all be glad that the tilapia fish you are buying at the market are freshly produced right in our own backyard here in Riyadh through this Lanofis farm. Lanofis farm is located 180 kilometers away from the center center of Riyadh and this is right beside the golden sand dune of Gazab. Yes, this is in the village of Gazab. Lessons come one in a dozen The other eleven give something from nothing 
Just open the door, one thing certain, I'll always be yours.